Hey everyone, welcome back to The Wasteland. My name is Finger Caesar, and you can see where I am on the map right here. Today I'm doing a guide on how to increase your relationship status with Kiri. Now this is important if you want to turn Kiri into a synth, which is a very, very human-like robot. Now the best way to do this is through dialogue options. And the rule of thumb to remember for dialogue options are you want to try to emulate rice pudding. You want to be about as bland and vanilla as possible. You want to say nothing that'll come across offensive and always try to do the right thing. So, join the attack? No, that would end up with you fighting someone. Ask for money? That would make you seem greedy. I'll talk to her. Although sometimes asking for money won't cause Kiri to dislike you, it's just better to play it safe than sorry, because you want to get these points as fast as possible so you can progress with the quest. Now, going inside, you're going to have to talk to Trudy. Now, talking to Trudy is a bit strange if you already know how this is going to play out or you've done this with a different character. You'll know that you can threaten her for the money, which is obviously not the best way to come across, end it peacefully, which is a good option, and they'll get you another relationship point. Or you can offer to help, which will get you another relationship point, in which case it'll branch off again, and you can go kill the jet seller, or say you, you won't kill the jet seller, and stay inside and kill Trudy. And that option will actually get you another relationship point. So your intentions matter more than your actual actions. What I mean by this is by killing Trudy, Kiri won't dislike you because your intention was not to kill Trudy, your intention was to kill no one. Even though this seems a bit strange, it's how the relationship status works with most people, or most followers I've seen. Not Killing a whole band of raiders is kind of negated by stealing one do. stim pack. This system just kind of rubs me the wrong way, which is why I like to use dog meat instead of most of the followers in game. But if you want to play a virtuous rice pudding man who's just trying to get some of that sweet, sweet robot lovin', then you go right ahead. It's better than extorting children, I guess. But you have plenty of options to do as well. Not saying that's wrong. Hey, look at that one good neighbor now. It's over here on the map. Diamond City's somewhere down in this corner over here, I think. Or something. I don't really know. Anyways, there's a general goods vendor right here. You can talk to them, and about after three minutes of conversating, you can tell them that your home before the war was beautiful. I didn't really add it because, once again, it was three minutes just for one relationship point. But talk to them and don't be a dick. Some things that don't seem to affect your relationship you status with that. Kiri is extorting people with nonviolent methods, i.e., Hey, just give me more money for this doing this. Kiri deal. doesn't seem to really care, and I don't Killing see why she would. She's a medical professional and cares about the death and or combat of things. If you're merely using your charisma, as it were, to ask for more money, money, it makes sense that she wouldn't care. Also, apparently breaking and entering doesn't really seem to bother Kiri either. As you can see right now, I'm breaking into this building. And she compliments me. She tells me I'm really good at it. So, that's kind of a hint that she doesn't care. Uh, what else? Codsworth doesn't like it when you take drugs, so let's see if taking Jet bothers her. Uh, jet. I'm gonna bind that to one. Here we go. She doesn't really seem to care. What if we murder people that we just broke into their house? Excuse me. Need to kill you. It is violent, but you didn't seem to care. Once you reach a certain relationship status with Kiri, she'll ask if she can speak with you. At this right? point, there'll be a prompt where you can ask, is everything okay? She'll confide in you that she wants to become a human, or at least be put inside of a human body. In order for you to complete this part of the quest, you need to have dangerous minds completed beforehand. That's the quest in which you kill Kellogg and take his brain and bring it to the memory den in the same town that we're currently in, Good Neighbor. Robots can do amazing things. Surely they've contributed now, if you have that quest already done, then you'll just get a marker to head over to the memory den. If you don't have that quest already done, then you'll be able to keep talking to Kiri about how you're looking for someone that fits the bill, even if you've already been to the memory den and know of Dr. Amari. And even if Kiri's already had a conversation with Dr. Amari, you can't progress until you've done Dangerous Minds. So I suggest that you do do part of the main quest in order to progress past this point. So starting from the beginning of Good Neighbor, I'm going to show you how you get to the memory den. You just have to follow the path I'm taking right here. Don't ask questions in Good Neighbor. Don't ask why. Even if I did, the ship's kind of sail on me being a credible source, I think. I'm sitting in a room alone talking to myself. And with NPCs in the game. I think you're fine, bud. Alright, now we just gotta go find Dr. Amari. She's over there tapping around her computer. She's gonna apologize for Vault 111, most likely. I'm so sorry we put you through that again. Way to go, way to be predictable. Where the hell's Kiri going? Doctor, my friend here needs your help. Oh, oh she's coming back. A mechanic. What could she possibly want from me? Greetings, Doctor. And I she's leaving again. Where's she going? 
After you're done talking to Dr. Amari, you just have to wait 24 in-game hours or one day. That means come sit on this red couch and scroll up to 24 hours on your wait meter, because you need to be sitting now to wait. Because sitting and waiting is more realistic than standing and waiting for 24 hours. I don't know, man. I don't know, though, man. Well, at least now you have a French-speaking waifu. And that's good, right? It's like Charlotte from Infinite Stratos. She was like, best girl, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. You know what I'm talking about. Segway! Anyways, if you want your follower to be stronger, then there's a link in the video description below of how to make your followers stronger. And if you want to learn how to actually get Curie as a follower, in the weird circumstance that you follow these steps but you don't have her as a follower, I'll also leave a link to that video in the description box below. But anyways, I hope you guys liked this video. Like it if you guys did, and subscribe for some more of Skyrim I, and or Fallout content. I enjoy both anymore. those games. Life support ain't easy or cheap, you know? I was gonna pull the plug on her. What you're proposing sounds a little better. Better well, I hope you enjoy lot. the rest of your week, and here is Kira getting outside of her pod. She See you later. Giving what's left of her life for someone else. So this shouldn't take long. Yes, there. <gasps> I, I, my chest. What is happening? Just breathe. It's an autonomic function. Just let your body do what it must. I. I feel... I feel so strange. Listen to me. Can you hear me? What is your name? My designation is Contagion's Vulnerability Robotic Infirmary Engineer. Or Curie. You have me worried there. Do not concern yourself. I feel better now. Good. Very good. Now let's test some cognitive functions. What is one plus two? Three. If I threw a baseball at your head, what would you do? Uh, move. Think of a strong memory. The first that comes to mind. Tell me about it. <sighs> Dr. Borrow was very old. He was the last living scientist in my section of Vault 81. He was on his bed, very weak. He said to me, Curie, you must... And he died before he finished the sentence. Oh, my insights feel peculiar. What is that? Are you okay, Curie? I feel functional, but this feeling, my chest is tight. Poor Dr. Borrow. The operation appears successful. But I think it will take a lot of adjustment for your new friend. She may need your help to make the transition. Thank you, Doctor, for this opportunity. You your memories of Vault 111. So since the bombs. I'm so sorry we put you through that again.